Hello everybody, <clears throat> and welcome back to another installment of Pepe Martello video game. We gotta go to the desert. The desert. You know? You know? Yeah, you know. Actually, there was a mini game, like, down here I said I was gonna play next time. Maybe I could play that right now. How much money I got? 47. Maybe I can play the mini game before we go to the desert. Hello, Zeal. No! Don't go back in there. Okay. When the game starts, 11 blocks will appear. When you hit a block, a panel will come out. Okay. 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 Okie doke. No, I just read him. I just read him. Let's try five first. Okay, so it's really just... Pick one. Oh. <laughs> that did not go well. I got five Bowsers. Get okay, five coins. One coin. I'm not doing- I'm not having good luck with this. I'll play it, like, one more time. Okay. Five. Five. One. How do I leave? The game sucks. Get me out of here. We need to go to the desert. Goomba, what say you? We were we were just in there, my man. My main man. Okay, it has been dealt with. You're the best, Mario. It's nice to see the train up and running once again. It really wasn't a whole lot of fun watching it just sit there. Alright, take me to desert. Oh, thank you, Mario. The train's back on track. All aboard, this train is bound for Mount Rugged. Are you coming, Mario? You bet. You bet. Sit tight, folks. Now departing for Mount Rugged. Okay, now for train music. Chapter 2, The Mystery of Dry Dry Ruins. Mount Rugged, Mount Rugged. Passengers heading for Dry Dry Desert or Dry Dry Outpost should proceed directly over Mount Rugged from this station. 
Hang on, let me just check something real quick. Check, check, test. Yeah, okay. Okie doke. Okie doke. Trains running again. Phew, about time. I can finally go back to Toad Town. Oh my god, it's the Turban Toad. If you want to go to Dry Dry Desert, you'll have to hike over Mount Rugged. Follow the arrows on the signboard so you don't get lost. There are a lot of scary creatures around here. If you're not careful, you'll get hurt in a big way. If things are looking desperate, you better run away really fast. At least I would. This seems like an ill-placed train station. Coin. 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 Egg. <laughs> I saw a creature called a Wacka on Mount Rugged. It was extra cute. I wonder why they call it that. Can't go that way. Can't hit that block either. Ah, oh, no, confound it. Where could it be? Oh, sorry, folks. Very sorry. I was looking for something and not watching where I was going. What now? Aren't you Mario? Why, you are. You're THE Mario. Hello there. The name's Paracary. I deliver letters. Um... I'm normally a letter-perfect postman, but I'm having a bit of trouble with a lost letter. Wouldn't you know it? I dropped it on Mount Rogan, and now I can't find it. If you happen to stumble upon a letter anywhere around here, please tell me, alright? My job could depend on it. I'll be searching this area thoroughly for a while. Okie dokie. Oh, it's a slide. We. Gotta grab those coins. Ooh. Mole! Mole! Tell me about the mold. Hard to say. Hard to say. Oh, <laughs> You cannot get me. I am too powerful for you. Why are we at 20 health? Why did- I feel like we shouldn't have that much. Oh well. Ah! Mole! Mole! Ah, sleepy! Sleepy Mole. Mole go to sleep. Get a refund. Oh, the last guy is immune. He drank espresso. Let's, let's jump on all enemy in a row. Oh crap, I, I messed it up. As I always do. Let's try it again. Six. And how many do I need to pass? 
Oh, hey, dude. What's up? Wacko! I'm Wacka. Just another picture perfect day atop Mount Rugged. Woo! The sunshine, the fresh air, so refreshing, Wackadoo. Hello, Zero Janitor. Uh, we just started. You know, this guy looked very whackable, but what kind of- what kind of monster would do such a thing? What kind of monster would ever- would ever do that? Big open field. Okay, so you get one hit on each one. I suppose that's fair. Ow. There we go. I'm kind of overusing this, I admit. But I guess if you got it, flaunt it. Oh, you just lose that online video game? I'm sorry. Millions suffer each year. I'm just gonna go ahead and kill this guy. It doesn't pay for me to skip enemies, I gotta level up. Especially when there's a heal block so close by. Man hit by football! Crap, messed it up. The Stone Luigi. You didn't make it. Mario, I am God, and I have created the Earth and the Sands! Okay, I'm gonna go back and heal. You know what, I'll save too, why not? Why not? So where was it? Oh, this is all the way back here. Oh, th yeah, there it is. But it is worth it. I don't know if the enemies stay dead. That is a chance I am willing to take. They don't. They don't. But you know what? I killed them once. That's good enough for me. Oh, wait, these... No, no, no. Oh, there's, there's a thing up there. Okay, we're mostly getting Monty Moles. I could probably, like, I keep Goombario out in case I need to tattle a dude. Because, you know, we're in a new area and everything, but... Right now, we're mostly just getting Mole. I mean, I guess it's not hurting anything. Oh, honey! Honey! Okay, yeah, I need- I need coops for this one. Okay. We got Paracarry's letter. Take it back. Because... RPG rules say that he has to reward me if I do so. I am not altruistic. I do things only for personal gain. 
Oh, that's the one. Oh, thanks for finding it. I'm so relieved. Uh, actually, I'm also looking for two other letters I may have lost. It wasn't my fault, really. If you find them, could you... Thank you so much. Okie doke. Yeah, yeah. Moving the goalposts. Moving the goalposts. Gonna save again. I mean, it's a cartridge, and we're saving to a battery. Saving's real quick. There's no Immunand here. Okay, that is a new guy. It's that dude. Paper Mario original enemy. This is a cleft. Clefts are pretty strong, so you better be careful. Their speciality is pretending to be rocks, so watch your step on the mountain. You'll get hurt if you jump on the spikes on their heads. You know, there's courage in running away sometimes. You know, he who coops and runs away lives to coop another day. Ow. Bl blow him up. Blow him up. Imagine going through life and your specialty is pretending to be rocks. <laughs> what is my purpose? You pretend to be rocks in the desert. Oh my god. You know, if I could, uh, blow this guy up. Okay, her, her range is not quite good enough. There we go. And this man is already deceased. See, that's really good, because normally the bomb move costs you, like, FP, so you can get one for free by doing that. Yeah, can't go there yet. I, gee, I can't help but notice that I can't go over there. I wonder if there's some sort of ability I will need to do so. Slope, slope. Oh no! He's falling on my head. Class keep falling on my head. Doing well, we're doing well. Go through the cave. There's a star piece down there. Don't know how to get it yet, but that's okay. That's okay. Rome wasn't built in a day, you know. I made a model of Rome in the city. Oh, that's how you do it. You know? You know, that makes a lot of sense. Okay. Oh yeah, another- another gap that I do not think I can cross. Hmm. Oh, letter. Letter. Oh no! Hmm. I don't know if there's anything that Mario can do against this dude without, like, FP- Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Yeah, I'm gonna have to run from this one. Yeah, but you'll lose coins. Remember, it doesn't pay to run away. Well, I mean, it pays the other guy. I mean, I found one. I haven't found the other, though. I don't think, unless I- unless I have totally forgotten. No, I just have the one. Maybe it's down this slide. Let us find out. Wee. Oh no. Oh no. 
Oh no. Oh no. Wait. Oh. You know, that, that felt like that should have caused a glitch of some sort. Okay, now we can get the drop on him. Okay, never mind, he walked away. There we go. It's probably gonna crash the game in three in like 300 years. Yeah, that caused a memory leak. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> Got the inputs confused. But Mario does a sassy finger waggle, so it's okay. Mushroom. Mushroom. Oh no, Mole. Oh no, Cleft. Here comes the Crimson Chin! Oh, there's- there's something over here. You bet you're bippy. I don't know what it is, but it's something. Well, there's a passage. Well, hang on. Let, let's see what's up here. Let's, let's see what's up the secret hole. The treasure. Damage dodge. Oh. You know, actually... That does sound pretty good. How much does it cost? It costs three. You know what? I'm not getting damaged too much. So, I don't know. I could take that off. Hmm. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know if it's worth it yet. Once I get a level up, it'll absolutely be worth it, but maybe not yet. Strategic bombing. Except now I have a problem because I, I'll, I'll have to charge. That is the only way. Yeah, this guy's- this guy's too strong otherwise. See, the thing is, if I- If I had that badge on, I could, like, nullify the damage. That would be pretty good. I mean, honestly, that's probably the cheapest way to kill him. But it also takes, you know, more turns. Honey! You know what, let me- let me use one. What button- what button is, a uh, use item? No, no. Don't- don't do that. Don't do that, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. <laughs> yeah, one of the C buttons, one of them. I mean, top is heads-up display. You you know that. I know that. We all know that. There's there's one over here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Mr. Johnny is chasing me. Maybe maybe I need to take the slide here. We. There we there we go there we go. How- how on earth you lost these over there? I got no clue. I mean, I guess you do fly around, I don't know. No, no! I- I, I stomped on the rock, I didn't know you could do that. I did not know that this was a thing that was possible. But I guess... You know, through God, anything is possible, so jot that down. Yo, here you go. 
Oh, there we go. That's one of the ones I dropped by accident. Thanks so much, really. Of course, there's still one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. The last letter! You found it! Now I've got all the letters I've lost today. Oh, thank you so much! You're a lifesaver. I wish there was some way I could repay you for your help. Actually, to be honest, I haven't just lost letters on Mount Rugged. I may have sort of dropped some all over the Mushroom Kingdom while I was flying. <laughs> yeah. You know, you're good at finding letters. Do you think you could keep an eye out during your travels? In return, I would offer you whatever help I can. Yeah, okay. Oh, praise the stars! I wasn't looking forward to having to find all those letters by myself, no sir. I'll do my very best to help. You shall not regret this. Paracarry joined your party. Press down to have him carry the fat spaghetti man. Now, onward! Oh, but hey, uh, by the way, if you want to deliver a letter to someone, just speak to that person. I have to be next to you at the time for it to work, though. Keep in mind, alright? Hello, Miles and Isaac. Okay, so we want to go back to those old areas because there's, like, items we can get. Is there anything down here? Oh, no, it's just Wacka. My good friend, Wacka, whom I would never hurt. Hmm. Stream seems to be behaving slightly weirdly. However, I can assure you it says I have not dropped any frames, so it might be just a Twitch thing. The Quake Hammer. Ooh, the Quake Hammer. You know, I'm more of a Doom Hammer guy, but, you know. Get, work with what you can get. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh! Okay, don't do that. That counts as a- oh, and he's dead. Okie dokie then. My toe! My toe! Well, this has been a crap show of fight. Let's try this. Yeah, aim it like a jachi. Yeah, aim it like a jachi. So the thing is, I don't know which way is actually progress. That's what the- Ooh, hello, Mr. Man. Huh? You're talking to me? I don't see anyone else here. All right, you are talking to me. It's been a long while since I first came here from my home in Flower Fields. But you're still the very first person to speak a word to me. Nobody ever notices me. The few people I actually see just think I'm blooming. I love a good conversation. Here, take this as thanks. This is a precious seed. Keep it well and remember me. Please grow my seed with care. It'll help you one day. Okie doke. Yeah, we'll need that later, but not for a while yet. Nope, 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 nope. I mean, there was like a star piece one of these ways. And I would like to get it. Launch. Nope, nope. <laughs> no. It was like, there's like something right here. Right here. 
Yep, there we go. And a few coins, just to make it... Just to make it worth your while. You can fall down, there you go. Okay, so I guess the only remaining way is the way to go. Slope and ramp physics. This is a good Paper Sonic game. He <laughs> even does the sassy finger waggle. Oh, nope. Nothing over here. Just wanted to make sure I didn't forget. Yeah, so... Cross this. Hey there! Hold up a sec, partner! Just a darn minute. I've seen you somewhere. Yep, very similar. You look a lot like this feller Mario who's on Bowser's Wanted poster. Now give, what's your name? Uh, Luigi. Hmm, well, Luigi, eh, pard? You do look like this dude. Well, you're not Mario, I guess. I reckon you can pass. Just gonna commit some casual identity theft. Okay, the D's art. Well, hello there, old boy. How goes the travels here? I'm known as Colorado. I'm an archaeologist, you know. I travel the world. At the moment, I'm turning Dry Dry Desert upside down to find the Dry Dry Ruins. My assistants have attempted to gather information in the Dry Dry Outpost, which is near here. Sadly, as of yet, we're having little success. All I need is a clue, and we'll be golden. You're Colorado, correct? The name's Paracarry, I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. I don't know why they make me select that. <laughs> Another letter, duty duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. Oh, good show. It's a letter from my wife. Thank you ever so, old chap. This is just what I needed to give me the strength to go on. I know. I'll pass this along as a spot of thanks. I came across it while I was immersed in the dig around here. Thank you very much, my good man. Yeah, it's very deserty. The ground kinda looks like garlic bread. Oh, no, come, come here, come here. That's right, we're gonna kill you. We're gonna kill you. This is a bandit. Bandits bump into you hard and shake up your pockets. They can steal up to 10 coins. They'll slyly approach and then slam into you all of a sudden. If you can damage them in an attack, you can get your stolen coins back. Let's beat them before they can make off with our loot. Yeah, so Yoshi's Island enemy. Ow. 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 I am not timing this well at all. Well, that's okay. I, I can get it back. But I need to switch to Cooper. Ow. 
Ow, I keep pressing it way too early. Uh, well, that was way too late. Mario is going to die. This much is unavoidable. Oh. Cooper, please kill this man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! <laughs> oh, boy. But that's a lot of star points, so... And I took a ton of damage, so I get mini coins. Uh, where was that? Where was that heal point? I am gonna need it. Hey, motorcycle dude, what's up? Pokey. Pokey. Tell me all about the cactus. This is Pokey, an evil cactus. Pokey's attacked by throwing parts of their bodies or by coming up close and falling on you. Be careful fighting them. It'll hurt if you jump on their spiky heads. Oh man, my the frame rate is gonna... Kind of crapping itself a little bit. They also have an annoying habit of calling in reinforcements. Let's beat them quickly. Okay. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, I'm gonna need you out of here. Sorry, dude, you're smart, but you're not strong. Oh, ow. Okay, there we go. There we go. We are so close to a level. Very close. I didn't time that right. I didn't time that right. Dang it, Paper Mario 64. Yeah, that's right. I'm blaming the game. Uh, let's let's eat this mushroom. There's always a whole bunch of them in there. I- I, I could never time this. Except that time where I timed it. You know. Just to- just to mix things up a bit. Just to keep you on your toes. I can taste it. I can taste it, my friends. Oh no, I missed one coin.
the s tornado. Oh no! Crap! I am now elsewhere. <laughs> I'm, I found my way back to the garlic bread, don't worry. Oh. Oh. That's it, you're, you're getting the fire. You're getting the fire. Mr. Electric, send this man to the penis explosion chamber and have his penis exploded immediately. But we leveled up. So now, I can put on that badge. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna put on damage dodge. Palm tree. Dry dry outpost. <laughs> Cheesed to meet you. Welcome travelers. You must have had a long hot journey getting here. Welcome to dry dry outpost. Mustafa, or Mouse Mustafa, is the leader of this entire town, so you'd better keep it in mind. Although you probably won't ever see him. Master Mr. Mustafa is the man, yeah. Master Mr. Mustafa is the man, ooh. Where's the man? No one knows. He stays hidden from his foes. Are you aware that there's a dojo in Toad Town? There is. A while ago, I took one of the dojo challenges and did pretty well, I must say. I got a second degree card. You look pretty strong, so... Huh? You haven't earned any cards? Every time you pitch shift your voice, Jennifer has the stank face when I look over at her and it's great. Come on now. It's just a little pitch shifting. What's the big deal? Hey, guess what? Hey, somewhere in the desert, there's a stone cactus. I know, I saw it. If you move three south and two west from there, you'll find something special hidden. Ooh. Ooh. Three south, two west. I'm not sure how to find it exactly, however. You should go there. Hey, want to hear something else? I know lots of other stuff. Useful stuff. Hey. Hey, did you know the desert is dangerous? If you get caught in a desert whirlwind, it'll blow you away and you'll get lost. Bandits are out there too. They disappear all of- or they appear all of a sudden running really fast, and they steal people's coins. There are many tales. You better pay attention to them too, because the desert is an unforgiving place. Hey, wanna hear more? Uh, no. Not really. Your information is obvious at best. Oh, I already thought I already thought you. Have you seen the old fortune teller in Toad Town? He's always right, so his fortune telling is famous. If you hit trouble in the middle of your adventure, it'd be a good idea to see him. You get if you get stuck. Ooh, ooh. Oh, where are you going? What's your deal? Oh, I want to go. I want to buy stuff. I want to buy some things. Are you from Toe Town? Wow, that's a ways away. Dry Dry Ruins. Nope, never heard of it. Sounds like a local fairy tale or something. Hey, if you're serious about looking for Dry Dry whatever, you should ask the information trader. Supposedly, this information trader lives in town and swaps information for items or something along those lines. That's what my friend says. My friend, this guy? Nah, he's way too shy to be an information trader. Hmm, are you addressing me? A composer am I, writing songs? Well, I try. 
Ugh, I wish I could find some lovely, heart-moving lyrics. I want to compose music filled with beautiful lyrics. It's my fondest wish. You think this guy knows Todovsky? You think this guy is Todovsky? <gasps> it's the man. It's the man, the trivia man. A brother and sister who are very close live a stop shooting star summit. H how close? The brother, Merlo, collects star pieces and will trade bed. Yes, I know, I've been there. Yeah, tell you where to find bed. Yeah. Okay, let me let me go save in case I get the question wrong. Car Wiz, it's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo. Wanna try the quiz? Yes. Then let's go to the question. Question. What ability does Goombario frequently use, Tattle? Correct! Yes, yes, star piece. Very good, very good. Hey, hello. I'm assisting an archaeologist, Professor Colorado. I came to Dry Dry Desert to excavate some dry dry ruins, but... It's hot as blazes every day and I'm constantly thirsty. I'm gonna quit and go home. God, I feel you. I feel you. Long ago, in this very land, there was a kingdom called Dry Dry Kingdom. King Mousta ruled over it. One dark day, he was betrayed by his subjects. In the uprising that followed, Dry Dry Kingdom was ruined. King Mousta escaped and vowed vengeance on his enemies. He gathered those faithful to him and defeated his betrayers. King Mousta's supporters were the original robbers who built Dry Dry Outpost. Oh, item. Item. No. Oh, this is the inn. This is the inn. Okay. I heard that an archaeologist named Colorado is around here looking for dry, dry ruins. You know what? Even if he digs up the entire desert, he won't find them. Well, that's kind of mean. Why would you say something like that? Keep this quiet. If this woman casts a spell on you, it might help you during battle. For instance, your attack power might get stronger, you might get more coins for winning. Other, stranger things may happen as well. But do not rely on this spell. By no means will it take effect in every battle. The spell can be beneficial, but it's also unpredictable. Yeah, I'll take one. Hello, welcome, how are you? Feeling jolly? Feeling blue? I'm Merly, you see? That's me! A cuter gal you'll never see. I do magic, but not for free. Your luck has steered you well, for I'm a master of the spell. When my spell upon you glows, you might get lucky, but who knows? Do you dare to take a chance? Watch my cut, yeah. Uh, I'll take, uh, normal. Well, we're ready, tally-ho, and here we go. Oh, I got the powers. I think you'll find this power might get your foes to cower. It will light your darkest hour. Even should you meet a beast, do not fear, not in the least. My spell makes a famine feast. See you then, please come again. Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> Enough rhyming. Oh, oh. Someone who gives things is nice, very nice. Nice guys get told nice stuff. Uh... You want some, uh... Fried shroom? Ah, you give me something. You might be nice. If you're a very nice guy, you'll give me something more. Uh... You can have... Honey. Ah, you give me something. You might be nice. If you're a very nice guy, you'll give me some- Okay, okay. 
Uh... Uh... More honey. You give me many things. Very nice guy. Yes, very nice. My name is Sheik. I trade in information, things others do not know. So nice guy, what would you like to know? How to get to the ruins? You must see Mr. Musta Mustafa to find the resting place of Dry Dry Ruins. Mr. Mustafa is a descendant of the great robbers who built Dry Dry Outpost. He is somewhere in the town, yes, but exactly where, only his close followers know. I could tell his secret, but only to the nicest of nice guys, yes. If you still seek knowledge, you must give me something more. Okay. Alright. Have this. I thank you for giving things. To show I'm truly thankful, allow me to tell you something. Uh... Yeah, you already... Okay. So I just wasted that for no reason. Cool. Oh well, it does- it doesn't even matter. Welcome, traveler. This is the renowned Little Mouse's shop of Dry Dry Outpost. What can we interest you in? Uh, I need to, uh... I'll just, I'll take this. But... I know, I know you know things. I know you know things that you know. And I know that you know. You know? The dried pasta. Yes, good, good. Hmm. Hang, hang on. Oh, uh, filter still on. Okay. Here, have a dried pasta. My favorite food starts with an L and ends with an N. It's a yellow fruit. So sour. Such a nice fragrance. Its tree grows only in the desert oasis outside town. If you were to go to the oasis and get one for me, I might believe you're a true nice guy. For, of course, only the nicest of nice guys can meet Mustafa. If you still seek knowledge... No, no, okay. So, you gotta go... I gotta go get a Lamon. I gotta go get Laymon. Okay. The search begins. <laughs> nope. 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 Maybe later. Come on. Come on. Kill! Oh god, there's always like 300 of these dudes. That was a good one right there. Didn't that one toad give direction? Oh yeah. 
three south, uh, two west. Or is it two south, three west? I already forgot. It is one or the one of the two. But since we're here... Since we're already in the brick zone... Are there secret bricks, anyway? Because these bricks do, do not have things in them. Well, except this one. Okay, let me let me go back down. Got to find the stone cactus. Bypassed. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? Hello, fellow travelers. I'm in the middle of a journey, just as you appear to be. If you go southeast from here, you'll reach a beautiful desert oasis where lemon and lime trees grow. It's nice and cool. Really, the best place to have a rest, but many enemies plague the surrounding area. If you plan on reaching the oasis in one piece, be careful. Okay, well that's... I mean, that's cool, but I didn't see the, uh... Where's the stone? Don't care. Okay. So, south... Let's say south twice. Oh, oh. Hitting this block crashes Paper Mario. South, south. And then west three times. Oh, blue. Blue. Oh, block. Block. Gotta get the block. Oh, did they, these just lead to the same place? Okay. They, they both lead to the oasis. Oh, oh. The powers have awakened. Now, I don't know if that means it's used up, or... Or if it'll, like, keep happening, I don't know. Yeah, you see what I mean, though? Damage completely nullified. It should happen at least a couple more times. Okay. Okie doke. Based on- it's- oh, so the number of times is based on which package you buy- okay. Ooh, drink. Oh, there's- why are there so many? Why must you do this to me? Oh no! Why must you do this to me? Oh no, I released it too early. Oh, now this man is just ahead. Cactus head. Yeah, you know, what, whatever. What, whatever. Whatever.
my fan barely feels like it's working right now. I, I truly feel like I am in the desert, dying. Well, okay, it's, it's not the worst it's ever been, but it, it feels a little stuffy in here, I'll tell you that much. Oh no, he's gonna nibble at my ankles. Yes, I truly feel immersed in this moment. Okay, what's in the box? What is in the box? Coin is in the box. You know, that's not particularly surprising, but... Tasty tonic. Cures poisoning and shrinking. You hear that, old people? Ah, uh, the oasis. Lemon! Lemon? Ooh. This is a super block. With this, you can upgrade one of your party members. The member you upgrade will gain attack power. Party member will also master a new ability. Which party member do you want to upgrade? Alright guys, what do you think? What do you think? Who should get this? I don't know if I have a preference, so I'm gonna ask you guys. I can't remember what attacks I get. I don't either. Who are you most likely to be using? I don't know. I don't know. Um. Oh, oh, it says right here what, what they'll get. He'll master charge. His attack power will go up. Dizzy shell to paralyze enemies. Power bomb to attack all on-ground enemies. Airlift to kick. You know what? I think Bombette sounds the best. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with her. Yes, my child, accept the power of God. Okie doke. Ah, and a heal block. Thank you. Get a lime. We can make Sprite! You actually can hit these trees. Ooh, what is this? Fine, you wanna- you want to tussle? You want to tussle? You want to fight? I have a nuke! I have a nuke! Yes! Die! Oh, what's that? What's that? Not enough nu- Oh, well, no, I'm not gonna waste a nuke on this. Remember those ridiculous subliminal <laughs> commercials? I don't know that I do. That doesn't sound familiar to me. Yeah, and she's also got better attack power now. So even her- even her non-special move is better. Oh, yes. No, don't- just don't do anything. Oh. Oh, I might have to buy this again. It's already using it. Limes are pretty good. I will say that. I will say that onto you. No, 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 no. Ring around the pokey. Pocket full of pokey. Okay, yeah, this I will nuke. Right? I like that they have separate sprites from when they have been nuked. 
That's attention to detail. Honestly, limes remind me of a, a milder lemon. Okay, now let's... Let's go into town. We will give this man a lemon. And he will give us the information we seek. Oh, heavenly, a lemon, the nicest of nice things. You have proven you're nice by giving me my favorite thing. And since you're so nice, yes, I'll tell you something really nice. Up to see Mustafa. To find Mr. Mustafa, go to the shop in this town. First, buy a dry shroom, then a tusty, dusty hammer. That's my hammer. You must buy them in the correct order. Dry shroom, then dusty hammer. This is the secret sign known to those loyal to Mustafa. If you buy these things in the correct order, they will let you see Mr. Mustafa. So, dust, so dry shroom, dusty hammer. You, you must not buy them in the correct order. If you still seek knowledge, no, no. I wish you luck in finding Mr. Mustafa, nice guy. Dang old Mustafa dog whistle. Okay, then. What ho? Buying a dusty hammer after a dried shroom? Is a secret sign that only friends of Mr. Mustafa know. That means you're in with Mustafa. You know, I feel like this is a secret sign that could very easily be discovered by accident. Hey, brother. Good to meet you. Have any questions you need answered? You want to see Mr. Mustafa? He's usually up on the highest part of Dry Dry Outpost. Just, just keep going up, my man. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. But then again, it is the crappiest items in the store, so who knows. Oh, I'm in the secret zone. I'm in the secret zone. I'm on the rooftop. Do, 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 do. Oh, I can deliver that. Hey, nice guy. We meet again. I'm glad you found me. I'm Mustafa. I'm the one you've been seeking all this time. When I'm out and about in Dry Dry Outposts, I use the name Sheik. It's always good to meet a genuinely nice guy. I meet people all the time, but you are by far the nicest guy I've met so far. Your name is Mario, yes? I heard that you want to go to Dry Dry Ruins. I have a feeling you are on an important journey, so I will tell you the secret. Dry Dry Ruins is a very important place. My ancestors have watched over it for many generations. If I do not keep evil folk out of the ruins, who will? You must promise me that you will tell no one this secret. I'll give you this. The Pulse Stone. This Pulse Stone is the key to finding dry, dry ruins. Take it to the desert, yes? The Pulse Stone will flash above your heads as you get close to the ruins. The closer you get to the ruins, the faster the Pulse Stone will flash. Follow where it leads you. Find the place where the Pulse Stone splashes the fastest, and use it to open the way. Thank you, sir. <laughs> hey, ZK. Alright. So we got what we need.
Yeah, honestly, it feels like I, I got to this a little quick. Like, I think chapter one took me a bit longer. Oh, uh, I, I, I've already got a full load. My load is much too large. But first, let's, let's find that mouse. Where is he? No, get out of here. Oh, is he not? Is he not? No, there he is. Okay. I got a letter for you. Traveling Nomad Mouse, correct? The name's the name's Paracarry. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter, do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A letter to me from Mustafa? I've heard the name, but I can't remember who he is. Anyway, thank you for delivering it. I'm surprised you find, found me way out here. It's extremely hot traveling in this desert, so take care. Oh yeah, take this as my thanks. Don't hesitate, please take it. Yep. Can get some good bag. Some bag to put on. Okay, beeping kind of slow. Beeping a little faster. Okay, what is it? Yeah, get, get rid of this. Get rid of it. Don't eat it. I mean, we can probably do the dungeon <laughs> this stream. Beeping faster. Place it into the rock. Why is it dark? Why is it dark? Oh my god, the ancient palace. King Tootin' Putin's tomb. <laughs> oh, but he knows. He knows what's going on. He's like... Yes, I know what's going on. <laughs> I like the chain chomp totems. Is there a save block? I see the heal block. Hit that. Hit it. Okay, now... I have a feeling I'm gonna have to tattle some stuff, so let's get Goombario out here. No, no save. Maybe there's one inside. Yep, right there. Blah! Blah! I'm the huge scary Tutankhupa. Koopa! Remorseless king of the desert. Who dares set foot in this, my palace of the sands? Speak and be known. Be gone from this place now, or disaster will befall you. Oh, uh, I like this track. Oh, blue poke. Blue pokey, blue po po pokey, blue pokey. He's like pokey, pokey mummy. This is a pokey mummy. Pokey mummies are pokies that dried out and became mummies that then went to live in the ruins. Oh, so they, they, they went to the ruins after they became mummies. Okay, sure. Careful, they have spikes on their heads. Trust me, it'll hurt if you jump. Yeah, I know. The modification also made them poisonous. If you get poisoned while they attack you, you'll take damage for a while. Why do you say we beat them before they can poison us? Good thinking! <laughs> they went to hell before they died. So it's as important as can be that I parry these attacks. Why did I just call it a parry? I have no idea. <laughs> 
<laughs> so like the star spirit being kept here, did they have to pull the ruins out of the ground, imprison them, and then put it back in the ground? <laughs> did the sky darken and every time, everything, every time it moved? Yeah, and come to think of it, how would they have done that? Did, like, did Bowser get the stone? I mean, I guess he has the star rod. He could probably just say, I, I wish that this star spirit was 40 feet underground. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you know that you could change selection with the R button? How peculiar. Oh no. Okay, but I did not get posened. <laughs> Cosmo Wanda, I wish the sentient being was in a forgotten tomb. <laughs> Oh, there's a badge in there. There's a bag. There's a bag. I should probably be using, like, my star spirit heal more. Because, I mean, I have it to use. I assume I can't use it in the overworld. But I also have not attempted it. So, you know, like, it could, it could. I don't know. Okay, let's see. Let's, let's see. No. The Elder. Yeah, I mean, I guess if it's not on a C button, then I can't really do it. Let's Mario jump on a spiked enemy without taking damage. Hmm. That's pretty good. I don't know, maybe I should nuke. I mean, it's probably too late for me to nuke at this point. It's not fully efficient anymore. Hurt me. Oh no, this is like the worst time for you to do this. Okay, keyhole. So I need to go down here for oh grab key. Oh, but there's a door that's slightly too high for me to enter. And a suspicious amount of sand coming from the ceiling. I wonder what this could mean. Ah yes, this room is filled with sand. Yeah, this and Kirby 64 are- they are very pretty Nintendo 64 games. But I mean, this is also a very late Nintendo 64 game. In fact, it, it might have, the GameCube might have already been out by this point. Fool! You have ignored my warning, haven't you? You fool! You will fall to my legions and become a mummy of the sands. Okay. Bu Buzzum beetle. Buzzum beetle. Oh, I feel bad for him. Oh, never mind. Never mind, I no longer feel bad for him. Oh, okay, same year, but Paper Mario was early 2001 and GameCube was late. This is a Buzzy Beetle. Buzzy Beetles are cute, but mean. Fire attacks don't work very well against these hardheads. If you can flip them, though, their defense power falls to zero. Keep flipping them, Mario. 
I heard that they used to flourish all over the place, but now they're only found in dark, shadowy places. Oh, uh, we're diminishing the buzzy beetle population. Ow. Too early. Did it way too early. Way too early. Like, now, now the problem is, now that I know you gotta do it, like, really early, I'm doing it too early. <laughs> and I'm just completely... Just, like, I'm doing it one hour before the attack lands. Funny number. Funny number. Oh, give me that. Give me that. Okay, so what we want to do... We want to go over here. And now we want to do this. Double partner use. Yes, the key. A particularly old key, if I may say so myself. I also like that they have this lump of sand right here that they really didn't even need to have, but they but they did. Ooh, ooh. Hang on. Detonate! Oh, no. <laughs> no, no good. No freaking good. They really are quite stonk. <clears throat> one day, one day, I will get the timing right. They make bomb shelters out of these guys. Well, some have uh, derided this practice as inhumane. However, buzzy beetle poachers still are still quite active, unfortunately. Oh, the puzzle. The puzzle. Very sussy. Oh. Oh, yep, there they go. There they go. I'm not trapped in here with you. You're trapped in here with me. I probably need Cooper for this. Like, Bombette, Bombette's increased might will be good, but maybe not yet. Maybe not yet. <laughs> Ow. Because these guys are all spiked. And that is not good for me. No! No! You have given Mario the pox! The ancient disease of the pyramid. Mario drank the tomb water. Oh, oh, swoop, swoop, bat, bat, swoop. Well, maybe I should kill this guy first. And then I'll, I will tattle the swoop. I don't even know if this game even keeps track of, like, your tattles. I just know that Thousand Year Door does. Oh, okay. I mean, I needed, I needed that one in order to figure out. So, I need... <laughs> I need to switch to Goombario in order to tattle. And then I probably need to switch to Paracarry to actually kill the thing. Go ghost Bat. 
for this game. It's just the convenience of not equipping peekaboo. Earth trimmers. Yeah, paracarry. Yeah. Yes, thank you. Please take care of him. So that I may also take care of him. And we will take care of him together. Oh, I'm close to another level. Nope! <laughs> yeah, just carry me- carry me right in there. You know- you know what? You know what? Refresh me. Refresh me. <laughs> Give me the lemon-lime drink that I crave. No, 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 no. No! I just got refreshed! I was just refreshed. Can't do this to me. Hello, bingo boat. Oh, I am not. Mario is not doing well on this day. He has turned green. Green! But, I have solved the puzzle. Hang on, what was- what was all this about? What was this about? Oh, okay, it, it swaps the stairs, but I can't do anything with that yet. I have a feeling I know what is going to be in this next room. Left, up, right. Uh, wait, come on, don't go in that room. Oops, uh, him, I, I mean. Flee now while you still can. If you continue, uh, you'll, you'll feel a horrible curse. <laughs> oh yeah, that was good. That was good. Oh, puzz we're puzzling. We are puzzling. I was hoping he would wall jump. Not in this game, he ain't. <laughs> yeah, he can't do it. He can't make it happen. Don't jump on that. Would Paper Mario wall jump or turn into a paper airplane? Well, in Thousand Year Door, he does exactly the latter. So, there you go. You got the super hammer! Mario's hammer is now... less... bright... it's now brighter than ever before. You can now destroy stone blocks. Huzzah! And you get a different sound effect for it, too. Just to make sure you know, you know what you got. Can he destroy dirt blocks? Yes, and brown bricks. Which is in fact, oh, which is in fact the most fun you can have while playing an app. No! I hit the stairs. You know what, you know what? Bombette nu nuke this guy. 
Drop the nuke on this man. Turn back, thief. Your time is running out. If you do not retreat, you'll be in grave trouble. I do not lie. You will regret it. Oh, wow. I didn't think that would work. But now I need to go down here. There's another upgrade. Okay, so... Hmm... What, what do we do? What do we do with this? Mm, I'm leaning towards Cooper because we're in this area. You know, yeah, I'm gonna go with Cooper. Good, good. Now we got two. We got two at super rank. What's in here? Oh, stone chomp. Stone Chomp. But I need to tattle. Hello, Mixling. Nice to see you. Okay. Use use the super hammer. Mario, crush this man. Crush this man's head. Ow. Ow. <laughs> when was my save? First game over, I guess. <laughs> well, alright. Wait, 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 wait. Is this at the start? Is this at the start? You have got to be, like... Oh, you have got to be kidding me. You, you mean to tell me I have not hit a single save point this entire time? Well, I guess we're doing it again. We are doing it all again. I think I'd like to do it a second time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, let me tell you, that was a load of barnacles. tattle him later. Or we'll tattle this next guy, at least. And let me- let me see. Let me see some. Yes, yeah, stats. Badges, items. Hear it. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it keeps track of it anywhere. But yeah, it, do it does let you permanently know the HP, so it is still, like, handy. Yeah, so we're just gonna- we're gonna skip past that. Just do what we need to do. What? <clears throat> well, you know what? You know what? Lesson learned. Lesson learnt. Some lessons gotta be learned the hard way. Or the medium way. Or the semi-easy, easy, medium to easy hard way. Can you do grass knot? I have no idea what you're talking about.
He's trying to communicate with me, I know it. Oh, but I got a free drink. Hmm, you know. God, what's the item button? No, my coin is fading away. Oh, no, I still got it. Okay. Don't worry, don't worry. We'll we'll speed run it. We'll speed run it. I'm like now that I'm not reading any of the text. I think Grass Knot is a moving Pokemon. Yeah, I had a feeling it was something like that. You get it because because they're both RPGs, I, I guess. So he's, he's trying to tell me to use a move from one RPG in the other RPG, despite the fact that that move is not in this, and he knows that. It is quite hilarious. But now we know how to better deal with these guys. Okay, again, really weird time to use this. You know, there's a there's a boss fight coming up if you wanted to like wait for that. Making the joke because green Mario is in this game. True, but he is not grassy, he is merely dying. Uh, God, I can't... I, I just am... I'm bad at timing. I can't do it. Timing... I am allergic to timing. Just like Mario is allergic to cactus. Jump in the cack. Good. Sir, Mario is a human being. He does not have a type. Well, he does have a type, and that, that type is princesses. Okay, speed, speed earn. Speed earn. No, wait, this is the, this is the way back. Don't go there yet. Go there before, in, in a little bit. But don't go there yet. Pauline is a princess. Well, you got me there. You got me. I mean, all women are princesses in their own way. She really does a meaty whack. Both chuckle. So that was the key door. Yep, key door. Go in here. No, wait. That was the triangle. No, wait, I got the key. I got the key, right? Right? Yeah. And I can't do anything with that yet. I, I have to kill. I have to engage in murder. I mean, they're already dead. Crap. Bombette! Bombette, why do you fail me?
What type of murder? You're looking at it. The murder is happening before your very eyes. <laughs> what I'm doing right now is basically that guy from like America's Got Talent who's doing the speed reading where he's like I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> Cooper. Just give me Cooper. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? It'll give me more star points. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I appreciate that very much, Lee. Uh, Great. Oh, boy. You know what? You know what? Can, can you get rid of some of these guys for me? <laughs> Yeah, get get him out of here. I, I don't even want to see him. Mm. Very very close to a level again. Why do I gotta wait for that animation to finish? Okay, we almost got the hammer again. And then, that's probably when I will need to save again. We ain't- we ain't letting history repeat itself. Because they say, those who don't learn from history are, you know, something, something, I don't know, I wasn't listening. I fell off the platform, but this is merely a minor inconvenience. Are you still committing to finishing chapter two? I mean, I'm gonna try. At least finishing the dungeon. Why not use save states? Or is this original hardware? Yeah, this is original hardware. And besides, I, I just don't play that way. Homie don't homie don't play that way. The artifact. Yes, of course, the artifact. How 
I like the slight, like, distortion that makes it look like the room is, like, circular. Got a lot of coins. Okay, there, there we go. Now we're safe. Oh no, except for that. Except for that. Okay, blow it up. Blow it up. Okay, so we're we're roughly back to where I was now. Do you like Paper Mario or Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door better? Uh, Thousand Year Door, but this one's also very good. Oh, also, if you notice, like Mario is very subtly lit, like his sprite. Like, like, he's lit from the back. I don't think it changes depending on where in the room he is. Or does it? Wait, 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 hang on, hang on. The back of his hat. Does the back of his hat change? It does! It changes. God bless. Ever played Bug Fables or Paper Mario 3D Land? Yes, I have played both of those. Okay, so first I need to tattle. I should have had Goombario out to begin with, but... You know... Y you know... Yeah, there, there. Okay, tattle this. This is a stone chomp who guards the treasure in this room. He's made of stone. Duh. His jaws can supposedly crush a coconut. I don't know about you, but I don't want to become a snack. Yeah, that kind of... That kind of sounds like it would suck. Yeah, there we go. Can, can he do damage to this guy? No, he cannot! But yeah, I, for, I forgot if I answered Mixling's question, but yeah, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, but... But I like both games quite a bit. Oh, like, the first three are very beloved to me. The Diamond Stone. Don't. Okay, now I can properly use Bombette. Oh, the... The tunnel. Ah, oh, no, there's one on the ceiling. There's one on the ceiling, you know what that means. It means I'm gonna have footprints on the ceiling. Oh, okay, I've been- I've been blessed for this battle for some reason. Okay, he's on the ground now. It's fine. Oh, 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 it's so close. It's so close. Okay, so we got a map of the dungeon showing us where all the stuff is, I guess. Mm. Ever played Paper Jam? Yes, I have played that one too. Okay. Okay, game. I get the I get the hint. I get the hint. <laughs> Ow. Ow. 
Yeah, just just fail both of those. It's it's cool. Yep. Just That's fine. Just do nothing. Just that attack doesn't need to do anything. Yeah, press the button. Press the button at the wrong time. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Multi kill. Now, I think I either want FP or more BP. What do you guys think? You guys have any preferences on that? Also, this is the, this is the grassland thing from Mario 3. Okay, FP. I mean, that will allow me to nuke more things. How about AP? What does that stand for? Asshole points? Because you've got a lot of those. <laughs> God, can I just, can I just like push a button for once in my life? Wait, why- why is Peric- why was Pericary frozen in time? Why did Mario activate the world? The button! Push! Of course. Of course, the wall becomes steps. Just like in my own home. It's exactly the same thing. Yeah, so like, I'm trying to look at this. I'm trying to parse this. There's there's one like up. Oh no. God, why does there have to be like 300? Yeah, yeah, all of you get flipped over. I know they're immediately about to undo it, but just give me this. Let me get my satisfaction. Okay, there we go. Like I said, now I'm doing- now I'm doing it too early. I'm doing it like eight hours before I'm supposed to do it. Like I push the A button, and then eight hours later, the enemy shows up. It's like I've, I've already put the controller down by that point. The game's- the game's over in my mind. I mean- I mean why even bother? It's not gonna do anything. No, I didn't push the button because I waited too late because this guy makes me want to wait too late because I pressed the button too early and he does some max damage. Oh, more coins. More coins. The, the A button. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah, here's the place. Here's the one place... ...that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism.
Oh, it's the code. It's the code. Right there, it's triangle star moon. Crikey. Okay. I know how this is gonna go. Oh, never mind. He's not in there. But he's over there! The game's like, oh, we got you! You thought! You thought! Nuke! Nuke! Mr. Electric, send this man straight to hell! Oh, I missed a coin. Crap. So what was it? Triangle Star Moon. Okay, I, I'm still missing one. I still need to get the last one. No wait, no wait, this is where I just was. This is where I just was literally a moment ago. I mean, it said there was one up, I think. I don't know, I'm getting- I'm getting a little lost now. Just getting a little bit lost. Oh yeah, here we go, here we go. Oh, no, no, no. It's over, Anakin! <laughs> oh no! Bombad, hurry, clean up, clean up, <laughs> clean up my mistake. Thank you. No, no, flower, 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 no! Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Yes, Mario, lift the invisible box! Okay, nearly boss time. Sick. Music. This is your final warning. Enough of this foolishness. Leave at once. No. <laughs> oh, the little pieces, they converge. You! You ignored all those very scary warnings! Don't you have the common sense to get scared and run away? What's wrong with you? You shouldn't mess with Tutan Koopa, faithful follower of King Bowser. Oops, I, I mean... You shall regret this! Oh, uh, the good music. The good music. This is Tutan Koopa. He's one of Bowser's followers, and he's been assigned to guard one of the Star Spirits. I've heard that he has a sort of a pharaoh complex. He attacks by throwing shells from that high perch. 
Try to dodge when he uses magic. Its attack power is two, and it'll sting for sure. And he also summons Chomps, his loyal subjects. Those Chomps have some serious attack power. Think hard about who to attack first, Tutankoopa and Koopa or Chomp. <laughs> come, Chomp, come! Bite this intruder! Gonna need to tattle that, too. The Chomp. You've heard about Chomps before, I'm sure. Didn't even bother. They're made of such hard stuff that most of your attacks won't even phase them. I heard a rumor that the Chomps are a little peeved at Toot and Koopa because he works them so hard. Hmm, interesting. Ow. Remember when Sticker Star was supposed to have a Chain Chomp partner? Remember when Sticker Star was supposed to have a partner? Okay, we're gonna power jump him. <laughs> I'm a magical genius! Watch and be amazed! <laughs> oh no. I can't believe you've done this. Ow. I should probably refresh. Use items and stuff. <laughs> good, good. That makes me happy. You know what? Nuke! Nuke! Yeah, eat shit. Piss your pants. Ouch! What are you doing? That hurt! I'm king of the desert! You rude, rude man! Take this! Oh, he is out of shell now. Uh, that is not she can do. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I... I like when <laughs> the enemy has an attack that can hurt it. That makes me happy. Okay, please be gone with you. No! Aw, oh, come here, Chompy. Ah, what are you? Ow! Help! Okay, bye bye. The orb. See, that's the girl one because it has a bow on it. We got a peach segment coming. Thus, Mario and Party unearthed the legendary Dry Dry Ruins deep within Dry Dry Desert. They smashed Tutankoopa, the wizard, and freed Mamar, the second of the wish-granting star spirits. But the enemies awaiting Mario grow ever stronger, and the challenges more difficult. 
What's in store for Mario and friends? Where will their adventure take them next? Okay, it's everybody's favorite part of this playthrough. <laughs> Hello. How are you feeling, princess? Nothing makes me happier than a smile from you, Peach. Well, tough luck. I'm in a very bad mood, you monster. You've imprisoned all of the guests from the castle. You are the single greatest disaster to be ever befall the Mushroom Kingdom. I'll tell you what, I'll smile when you make everything as it was before you showed up. <laughs> oh, that's rich. You know I can't do that. That jerk Mario just beat the Koopa Brothers and Tootin' Koopa. Sure, they were complete wimps, but they were still loyal to me. I can't forgive Mario for disrespecting me. I'm nipping this in the bud right now. I'm going to use Invincible Tubba Blubba on him. He's the strongest creature I know, after me. You best forget about Mario. Your nastiness! We have a problem. Why, Kevin Koopa? What's got you so riled up? You look upset. Psst, psst, psst. What? The star spirit flew away from Tubba Blubba's castle? K King Bowser, keep your voice down. Princess Peach will hear you. Mm, yes, right. Tell me the details over there. Twink, did you hear that? Yes, I sure did. The star spirit must have escaped. Did you hear him call that tub of blubba thing invincible? That doesn't sound good. Do you think Mario can win? We'd better try to find out about tub of blubba. If we could find something, anything about a weak point, it just might save Mario. Good idea. Then there's no time to lose. We won't get anything done if we stay in this room. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. We'll have to use the secret entrance! Diary not there no more. How does she not get soot on her dress doing that? I don't know. There's still guards outside. Be careful not to get caught. Okay. Uh, Colonel. All right, Snake. You need to figure out a weakness of Tubba Blubba. There are guards here too. Probably lots of them. We better be extra careful. Oh wait, what if I wanna? I wanna explore the other place. Oh 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 no 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 no. There's nobody over here. There's nobody over here. Hmm. Oh, the crystal ball. Of course. No, no, there's nothing over here. Please, please. There's a box. Ooh. The deep focus badge. The Koopa Troll designs were so cool. Yeah, I like them. Star energy charges more than usual. Well, here. Oh, look there. What a beautifully crafted treasure chest. Yes, do you like it? This is a mysterious treasure chest that's been passed down through generations of my family here at the castle. Really? How mysterious. A mysterious treasure chest. That's right, this chest is connected to another mysterious treasure chest somewhere in the Mushroom Kingdom. They say you can put things in this chest and take them out of the other chest. Isn't that, well, mysterious? Yeah, wow, that's really cool. So where is the other treasure chest anyway? Uh, where is it? You know, I can't remember. Well, let's just keep- let's put the badge in there. I'm sure nobody nasty will take it. <laughs> I love that instrument. Okay. Colonel. Books. Books. 
Dana, Dana, Bene, 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 Bene. Oh, P, P, P. I gotta go deposit the P. Uh oh. Oh, oh no! Oh, you know, he's awfully- he's awfully polite about it, though. Okay, but I just- I needed to- I need to deposit the thing- oh, they don't make you walk through the hallway. That's nice. You don't see nothing. You don't see nothing. You don't see- oh wait. You don't see nothing. You don't see- no, you don't see it! You don't see it! Do not see. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. S speed boost. Speed run tech. If you move perpendicular to the wall, Peach move very fast. Yes, my therapist will be hearing about this. Okay, now wait, wait. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> you you didn't see that. You didn't see that. <laughs> hey, you think we should you think we should investigate how the princess keeps getting out of the room without us noticing? Nah. Nah. Okay. Okay. Now just like he can't see he can't see me over the desk somehow, but you know. Okay, now wait, wait. Wait. Okay, go in the hole. Go in the hole. He can't see. Actually, yeah, that's too close. Follow behind, follow behind, okay, okay, okay. Good thing he has extreme tunnel vision. Oh wait, there's something up there. I don't know how to get it. Hey, have you heard about Master Tubba Blubba? I heard a rumor that he loves eating ghosts. That's a weird thing to eat. Has he been on that, you know, My Weird Addiction show? You know, with, with the lady that eats the, the sofa. Ugh, ghosts, huh? Ah, uh, ghosts, huh? Master Tubba Blubba, he lives deep inside a forever flo florist, doesn't he? I think he's guarding one of the star spirits right now. Yeah, Master Tubba Blubba lives in the castle at the top of Gusty Gulch. I heard that somewhere near his castle is a mansion and a village full of ghosts. I guess Master Tubba Blubba sometimes goes there to catch booze. And then when he catches one, he gobbles it down, starting with its head. Chomp. What do you- what do you mean? They're- they're- it's entirely head. There- there's no other- what- whatever, whatever. Brr. Oh man, that's so scary. 
Now I won't be able to walk to the bathroom alone at night. And I'm gonna have nightmares, I know it. Why'd you tell me? I also heard that Master Tubba Blubba is in the, he's invincible. They say he can't be hurt. Nobody can even scratch him. He might even be stronger than King Bowser. Stronger than King Bowser? Come on, that's impossible. Even Master Tubba Blubba has to have some weak points. It's just common sense. Yeah, you may be right. There's another rumor that Tubba Blubba's got a secret that would ruin him if it ever got out. I bet it's about his past. I heard he didn't used to be strong at all. Shh. What if Tubba Blubba hears you? He might gobble us up. Yeah, that was on that was on purpose. Still, what do you think his secret could be anyway? I don't know. No one knows. That's why it's a secret, you half-wit. Twink, it sounds like Tubba Blubba has a weak point after all. If only we could find out. Huh? Hey, did you hear someone talking just now? Do you think someone knows we're goofing off in here? Oh, whoa, Princess Peach, how'd you get here? I'm sorry to do this, but you have to go back to your room right now. One day I will get that mushroom. Oh no! Well, I, I don't think we learned anything. All we learned is that, yep, he's got a weak point somewhere. Do we know what it is? No. Thank you, Mario. At last I can head home to Starhaven. My name is Mamar, so nice to meet you in person. You've still got a long way to go, but I just know you can save Princess Peach. I'll do my best to help you. Here's a present for you. Yes, give me the power. Give, give me the power. Lullaby. With lullaby, you can make all enemies fall asleep. Cool. Call, call on me when times are bad. Believe in this, Mario. My powers are strong. I'm a star spirit after all. <laughs> Our powers are growing all the time. Keep up the good work, Mario. You must save the other star spirits as soon as possible. For now, I'm going back to recover in Starhaven. Who knows how my dear old Starhaven... Who, who knows how my dear old Starhaven is faring without the Star Rod. Goodbye, Mario. I'm off. Squadula! Okay. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna head back to Toad Town and then I'll probably, like... end the stream. I, I mean, I'd pick up, like, the stuff. You know, the stuff. But... You know, who's got the time? Who's got the time? Oh, block. Find the garlic bread. No, no. Find the garlic bread. Oh, fire flower. Fi flyer flower. This dude is up my butt. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Please. Please, I must insist. I must insist. Did I have letters for here? Uh, I got two letters. Merlin. Ah, uh, yes. Merlin and Grandpa. And an artifact. That I don't know what it's for. No! Just, I need to go back to town. Do you want this artifact? Well, what's your luck? No clues about the ruins. I'm getting so frustrated, I might just have to give up the exp ex excavation for now. How very sad. Ah, sir. Mario, that artifact you hold in your hand. It looks like... It looks quite important. Do my eyes deceive me? Or is that a clue to dry dry ruins? Mario, old chum, I beg of you. Could you possibly part with it? Yeah. I don't know what to do with it. Cheers, Mario. Smashing really, old boy. Soon now, the mysterious dry dry ruins will arise from the sands that conceal them. As a brilliant archaeologist, I say it must be so. I suppose a thank you gift is in order, eh, old boy? Here you go, then. You now know a bit of the magic of the desert. Cherish the memory, old boy. Have fun. Nah, I'll do it right here, because there's something I want to do here later. But, uh, anyway. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in, everybody. Love you. Love you. 
I'll see you around. Next time, I'll, I'm gonna do more Spung. More Spungalbert. And, and then, and then we'll be back to this, of course. Bye-bye.